We're all powered. Hello, everybody. Nota27 here. Welcome back to Avatar Frontiers of Pandora. And we have something to get over here, which I'm going to guess is going to be a bellspring, because it usually is a bellspring. Alright, let's see what we're here for. Oh, it is a bellspring. I knew it. Alright, I just got to find a way in there. Let's land. I guess this is the way in. Okay, just, just land somewhere, Storm. Land anywhere. Land right here. What? Dismount then. Fine. I don't know why you can't land right there. Oh, God. Oh, you just went through a wall. I'm not going to question, Storm. You do whatever you feel you need to do. Here is the bell spring. All right, now there is one more purple dot on, like, an island, right? Yeah. Oh, and one over there that appeared. Okay. Nothing else appearing over this way? No. All right, so let's go and grab those two, then. All right, this is where the island is. Oh, is that a totem? Oh, my controller batteries are low. Oh, is this another memory painting? All right, well, let's do this. Is this one going to work? Here we go. Last one. Uh-oh. Whoa, my God. What the heck, dude? Just wanted to get a memory painting. Forgot about these creatures. Do we, do we need to fight? You guys can't be chill. Is he running? Oh, my God. I think he is running at me. All right, I see his weak spot under his chin. I don't want to kill them, though. I can't just get my memory painting, and we can all just, like, be chill. They seem to be chill now. We need to also make arrows. But they're not even fighting me. Just let me do the memory painting. There we go. All right, that's another one completed. And I got moved pretty far. Those things kept attacking me, but I just wasn't taking damage. They kept using, like, their blast wave ability, and they just sent me flying all around. So that one was more one of the fun ones, I guess, because of the creatures. And what are we looking for here? Oh, there's more of them, really? Can't just get what I need easily. What am I looking for? Oh, Bellspring. All right, don't attack me. I, I, just, I just need to touch a plant. Literally just need to poke the thing. That's all I got to do. There we go. Now, where'd you go, Storm? Let's get out of here. All right, and that's everything I really wanted, though, from here. Wait, oh, there's a totem there. Oh, I remember when I was here and it was telling me about a totem. I thought the totem be here. It was over here. Oh, I totally missed that. Okay. All right, well, let's grab the totem then since we're right here. Finding a lot of stuff in this one area. I'm not sure what number totem this is for the quest. Oh, one more carry. Hold on. Is there a kite here? On a big Zachary's tail. I don't know where that is. It says first Zachary. Oh, is it like on the back of this thing? On the mountain? I just want to get this. I know I need these. I need six more. Well, five after this. There it is. Always got to look out for when that quest updates. All right, well, now let's do the totem since we can. Yes, I know about the totem. How many? How many am I at there? Why did it bring me to the screen? I can't just make it pop up. Okay, so I need one more totem after this to get another reward. Let's start this one. Which way do I go? That way? I guess? Oh, yeah, here we go. Keep going this way. Do I need any more Daffafets? No, I'm good. Here's the next one. Go off this way. Am I going across the water? I guess so. That's the way it pointed. I don't know. I feel like I'm not supposed to be going across the water, though. I feel like I'd have to stay over there. Is there any, like, markers up here? No, I feel like I missed it. I don't think I'm supposed to be going across the water. I think it's somewhere over this way. Probably ran by it. Let me go back to that marker. Which way was it telling me to go? This way exactly? I don't even know where that thing was. Okay, well, there's that one. Told me to go here. And then I go to this one. Tells me to go this way. So I guess I do go across the water then. There's, there's really no other way. This is the exact way it's telling me. Probably just a little bit further on land. That's where the marker is. I already looked up here. There wasn't up here. No, so I probably keep going. Could be up here. 
Oh no, here it is. And I go this way. Probably hiding in that cave or something. Anything up here? In this rock? Can't even jump up there. Is this where I need to be? Oh yeah, here we go. And I go back this way. And I can use the leaf to help me fly. Here's our next one. Go back this way. Oh, is there another purple marker here? Oh, yeah. There's another wind flute. All right. Well, we'll probably do that after we do this. I just don't want to lose where we are with all the markers. I don't even know where this next marker is. Oh, there it is. Where was the wind flute? Eh, yeah, no, we'll wait. Probably close to where we need to be anyway. Oh, it's not up there. Can I see the totem from here? Not yet. Could it be up here? No, I don't see it up here. Okay, so it was right there, pointing this way. I think I just keep going this way. What is that? No, it's one of those pods I don't really need. Down here? God, here we go. These things are just like, they just become so hidden away at some point. Like, they just get so easy to miss. Is this the way I'm supposed to be going? I can't even see anything now. Oh, here we go. There we go, we found it. I can imagine Sada and two travelers gathering in a place like this to wait out a storm raging outside. They would make a fire, sit around it, and share stories from the clans they'd visited. And these stories would travel further, carried by those who heard them. How many stories have been lost and forgotten since your clan disappeared? Will we ever be able to recover these stories and tell them to each other again? That is a good question. They still give me, like, no clan favor. I swear, the Aranahe were not this stingy with their clan favor. They loved everything I did. Zakru, not really. Or Zeswa. Alright, let's go get their wind flute, though, through here. And then, I think this is really everything I wanted over here for the most part. Actually, a little more than everything I wanted. Didn't know all this stuff was here. Alright, let's tune this properly so it doesn't sound like garbage. There we go. Okay, we're all good over here with purple markers. Good, I don't want, want one surprising me out of nowhere. Okay, where was I going to go? I don't remember. Oh, I think I was going to head over here, right? Yeah, they wanted the fire seed, which I have now. I didn't get that. So let's head here. Okay, here's their contributions. Here we go. H hand that in. That actually might be all of part one done. Oh, yeah, it is. Nice. So what did I get for that? I got a new recipe and new ankle guards, which actually I think are better by a pretty good amount. I want to say they are. We got part two. How many do you got to do there? Five? Yep. We probably already have five. We should have to actually go and get the stuff. Yeah, this says 60. And these ones are, what, 74? All right, and we're level 15 now. Look at that. That is very good, which means now that we're level 15, we can do one of the quests. I don't know which one it was. This one, the Feral Hunter. Well, actually, we I don't really know what we have to do, though. What does it even say? When roaming about with a series of cryptic codes in their bellies, all three animals escaped a sinister RD episode years ago where cruel experiments were formed on them. Find the purpose of the access codes. I still don't know where. I have theories. Oh, oh, my controller just died. Awesome. <laughs> Let me get new batteries. All right. Got all my new batteries. We are all set to go. What is that? That's a person. You have a side quest? Oh, you do. I have a story for you. All right. Let's hear it. My brothers and I ran into the severed. And were forced to run. They have no fear of death. Do you have no other clothes? Alright, we got another severed bonds quest. See, I don't know, because this is like the first one we've gotten in the plains, though. So, I don't know if, like, maybe this one will show us where, like, a main one is. Where is that? Um, 
Oh, is that over here? Okay, we've never even been over there. Alright, well, we'll wait to do that then, because we're nowhere near there. Right now, let's go and get the uh, purple marker. Where's Storm? I don't know. Alright, purple circle's already appearing. What is that? Petrify tree. Is that another totem? Another totem. Oh, nice. The vantage point must be somewhere. All right, that's all the totems then. Actually, that's seven. That's gonna be eight out of eight. All right, that's very good. So we're gonna get another recipe for the uh, Sargento clothing, which I'll then need to find the stuff to craft. That'll take a while, but oh well. This one seems open. I feel like this one's gonna be a little easier to track. I hope so. Longer this stuff doesn't attack me. Is it in here? No. It was pointing this way exactly, right? Uh, what is that? River rock shell. Well, it's only fine, so I'm not going to get it. What is that? Creeping moss. I don't really think I need any of that. Where? Oh, here we go. That's what I need. Is that more of the moss? All right, keep heading this way then, into this tree log, I'm going to assume. Is this where it wanted me to go? Oh, here we go. Keep heading forward. We're going into, like, this tree here. Oh, here we go. And then I head into this tree. All right, well, we're using a lot of the trees. Can't see much in here though. What is that? Oh, that oh yeah, that's one of those eggs. All right, there's another marker. This leading me, I feel like, really far away from the totem though, like excessively far. I feel like I wouldn't be able to be able to see it now. Ah, uh, where am I looking for now? Somewhere in here maybe, or around here? There it is. They seem to be like surrounded by these. Oh, so I go up now. Oh, there they are. And then I go back this way. I'm going like a whole loop right here. Wait, do I need to be up here? Wait, now I'm confused. Wait, where was that? It pointed this way. I don't know if I... I'm going to assume I need to stay up here. I worked hard to get up here. Which way do I go? Let me just stand here. Let me line it up perfectly. I gotta go somewhere this way. Is that it right there? I don't know if that's it. I don't know. That's a leaf. Okay. Where's the totem? Like, I don't even know where it is. Oh, there it is. Do I need to observe it from up here? I mean, like, it looks like I kind of do. I just don't know where the actual, like, observations, like, part is. Oh, I probably gotta use that. Oh, get up there. There we go. And now I gotta go over this way. That's where that one's telling me to go. It's pretty sure. Yeah, nothing else to do up here. Alright, let me get down to this one. And then we go this way. Through here. This is like the most confusing one. I, I literally said this might be the, like an easier one. I was clearly wrong about that. Is this it? Oh, wait. I think I just walked over it. Here we go. An ancient forest. Maybe once it was imposing, but now it's just a bunch of hollow trunks. It's like the totem wants me not to see the dead trunks, but to look forward at the plains, at that towering rock, at the sky. Is this an invitation to move forward, not to dwell in the past? Getting it wrong? Ritnella, I'm sending you coordinates for some more totems. You don't sound as excited as before. Did something happen? It's just, as I look at more of these totems, I feel more connected to our people. But I also feel... Exactly. Thinking that all this is lost, forgotten, it's just... I've been having the same thoughts lately. And I think nothing is really lost. The fact that these totems exist, and we can engage with them, I think this means we can rediscover what it means to be Sarendu. Define it for ourselves, and carry this knowledge further. I hope
hope you're right, Rinella. Thank you. It's something worth thinking about. Well, if I got the waist cloth recipe. Now I need to find just two more to get me up to ten. So, where was that recipe? Oh, wait, I can make this now? Oh, that's why I needed the shell. Oh, I need this for a contribution. I should actually do that. Uh, where am I? Oh, I'm in designs. I didn't even know this was like a menu. Oh, I just got the waist cloth. So, I need... I actually already have that fiber. I need a storm glider tooth, which is hard to get. And wind bent bark. Aren't I right near that? Didn't we just see wind bent bark? Oh, we needed superior, though. I don't think we were near superior. Oh, well. Either way, I got what I need. Alright, so from here, let's go over to this field lab. We can just fast travel right here. Go, archipelago field lab. I didn't realize I was flying over it. Oh god, don't land right on that plant. Come on, storm. You did that on purpose. Where's the generator? Why? Why is it on the roof? I don't like when it's on the roof. It doesn't make sense. Who shoves generator on a roof? Well, at least I was the only one, though. Alright, this place is all powered. This is a very easy one. Let's see, I don't think we've taken out anything since our last one here. Yeah, we're still at 42. No calls. I might as well make that headband while I'm here. I know I need to contribute that. That's my only shell. Actually, am I going to make this better than what I have? If I make this better, I'm not going to want to like give it away. It's work. I mean, I might as well. I'm not going to use a really good tooth. If I'm just going to contribute this immediately, just use this one, only 22. No point in making this super good. Alright, uh, okay. And then, do I, I don't have what I need to make this, do I? No, I try to track some of that. I don't I don't think I need the shell anymore, really, because I have that now. I don't need the fire seed. I need any root. Hunters, anything in particular? What's the easiest one to get? I have no idea. Let's just pin that. And then I need any reed. It, has to only, it only needs to be a fine reed. I think these ones I usually see easy, so let's get that. Alright, there we go. So we have that marked now. Good, good, good. Alright, then you know what? Before we end off the video, let's just go hand in the, uh, the headband we just made. Why not? I don't even know where I hand that in. Oh, wait. Isn't that what I just had? Did I actually need a river rock shell to give in? Oh, man. Oh, well. Either way, I'm still able to hand in something. And now I know I need another shell. Where? Okay, we're going right back. Wait, why is that marking the skill? Oh, is it meant to mark here? Okay, that's why. Alright, here's their basket. Give them the headband. I don't even think they gave me any clan favor for that. Well, that's not nice. Alright, but we have done that. Indigo hair tint. That's cool. Alright, so we're all good with that. So now, I think we've done... Oh, there's actually more camps down here I missed. Oh, I hate when I randomly look and I see stuff I missed. Because now I just need to go get it. Oh, well, this is the circle right here. Okay. Alright, then you know what? Next video, we'll get these two camps right here. Let me just mark them here. And then we're, we're going to start to make our way to the left side of the map over here. And oh, there's more stuff I can get. And we also got to start taking out some drills and stuff. I don't even know where I, where to really start. Like, wh where's the cutoff for the like the map? Because it's clear there's going to be a whole other area we're going to on the left. I think about here is the cutoff. I see stuff here, but I don't think that's really part of the plains over there. I think this is more the cutoff. This kind of line here of just, like, rocks. What's, the, like, the best way? Well, I'm going to be going over here. I guess if I loop around... Or I come up from here. I don't know, like, the best way to do this. I think this big base is, like, that huge one from, like, the forest. So, I don't think I can take this out. So, I'm not really going to worry about that. I just don't know how to, like... I'm just trying to think, like, the easiest approach to this. I guess if I go from down here and start to move my way up. Because then I could also get this ancestor skill over here. Because I'm near that. So, I think that'll be the plan. We'll get these two outposts. And then we'll start to move left from the bottom. That'll be it. So yeah, that is going to be the end of this one. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you next time.